So in this video, I'll be talking about the book, Keep Your Brain Alive. And basically, the biggest takeaway is that your brain is like a muscle. It's not a muscle, but it's like a muscle in the sense that it can be uh, worked out or you can exercise your brain, uh, just like you could with any part of your body. Now, your brain, there's two hemispheres. There's the right hemisphere and the left hemisphere. The right hemisphere controls the left side of your, bo of your body, and your left hemisphere controls the right side of your body. Now, the right hemisphere, that's where a lot of creative thoughts come from. And for the left side, the left hemisphere, that's where a lot of logical thinking happens. Now, what does this mean? So, it's just like your body. You have different parts to it. Same thing with your brain. You have legs, you have arms, you know, you have a chest, you have a back. They all have... You, you have different muscles in your body. And that's kind of like the same thing with your brain. Your brain has different muscles to it. So one of the things that you can do, or a couple of things that you can do to uh, exercise your brain would be to use your non-dominant hand more often. So if you're brushing your teeth, use your non-dominant hand. Or if you are, example, buttoning up a shirt, use your non-dominant hand for that. Another thing is you could just reach in to a bag or a purse uh, with your non-dominant hand without looking and, and feel around for whatever it is that you're looking for. Now those are just some things that you can do to exercise your brain. Uh, your brain is always looking for new experiences to make neural connections or connections within the brain. and so. Well, that's one of the ways that you can help exer exercise it by giving it new experiences. Uh, when we do things that are very familiar, it doesn't. It's like doing the same exercise on your body. You need to uh, shake things up. You need to give it. You need to do different things in order to work it out. So that's my takeaway: is that I need to give my brain. And hopefully you will give your brain a workout by giving it new experiences by using your non-dominant hand. Alright, well, thanks for watching. If you like my stuff, please subscribe and visit my page, my website, www.bookstakeaway.com. And thank you. See you in the next video.